We are on the road at Curtis at the Nebraska College of Technical Agriculture. Pleased to be joined now by Dr. Hank Bounds, who is the new president of the Nebraska, uh, University of Nebraska system. Uh, Dr. Bounds, welcome to the state. I am delighted to be here and delighted to be at Curtis. Well, let's talk about so far, you're about halfway through uh, the experience. Uh, what do you think? Yeah, so I started uh, Sunday morning making my way across the state about 20 communities, about 40 different stops, going all the way out to the western border and back around. Uh, it's exceeded all my expectations. I, you, know, you, can, you can only read so much about uh, what's happening at the university. You just have to get out and see it. You can only read so much about what's happening in the state. You, you have to give it perspective by seeing it, touching it, feeling it. Um, it's a phenomenal state. The things that are going on in research here are incredible. I mean, world class, world class, uh, groundbreaking research. It's making a difference in ag production and in so many other ways. So, I uh, just can't say enough good things about the visit so far. Let's talk about your uh, leadership style. Uh, uh, you, know, you come from Mississippi, which you know you had great success there. Worked your ladder, worked up the ladder fairly quickly. So, uh, so what is a Hank Bounds administration going to be like? So I, I think you hire good people, uh, hire talent, support them, and then ex expect them to perform. And so that's uh, that's sort of been my strategy from the beginning, and that's the, the same strategy that I'll have here. Let's uh, talk about uh, anything that you have on the horizon that you've seen in the last few days or maybe some, some things to really focus on. I know you've, you've touched on several issues as you've traveled around the state and uh, not only agriculture, water, but uh, that general overall experience. So, so, you know, part of what I'm doing this week and really for the next couple of months is listening and learning. Uh, before I can really talk specifically about what the future needs to look like. I need to clearly understand where we are. But in general, I think it's important for the University of Nebraska to be a giant in higher education. I've been quoted as saying that a number of times. And so what does that mean? It means a, a giant in affordability and access. Every young person in Nebraska that wants to attend college, we should figure out how to make that happen for them. And we should move them through to a degree in a timely way, and we should focus on doing it in four years. Uh, a giant in research. Uh, I would like to significantly increase our research portfolio, a, a giant in terms of size. You know, we, this is a state that has the lowest unemployment in the country, and that's a good thing, but it also is a double-edged sword because as you think about trying to bring other corporations in to create more job opportunities, sometimes they say, well, we, we can't come because you don't have the employee base. So thinking about how we grow that enrollment with resident students, but also with non-resident students. Uh, that gives us an opportunity to grow our employment base, but it also, it also gives us an opportunity to think about how we do a better job of keeping Nebraskans in Nebraska. So, um, you know, the, I, I want to find the four or five or six areas where we should be world class, be absolutely best in the world. Um, I'm, I'm convinced that we can do those kinds of things, uh, but, but first I have to listen and learn. I'd be remiss if I didn't ask you, you know, Nebraska is an agriculture state, but Nebraska is also a football state. New president, new football coach, you were able to take in the spring game. What are your observations? Well, I'll, I'll say this. There aren't many places in the country where 78,000 people pay to watch a practice. I mean, that, that says a lot about how passionate people are about their football team. Uh, I'm excited about that passion. I come from SEC country. Uh, and, you know, football is king there as well. Football is clearly king here in the state of Nebraska. Um, I'm hoping that we can turn that passion that exists in football into a passion. That it, it, we can convert that into more passion around ensuring the promise of higher education for more boys and girls. Well, Dr. Bounds, again, welcome to Nebraska. We look forward to following you in your tenure. Thank you so much. I appreciate this opportunity. Dr. Hank Bounds, the new president of the University of Nebraska, has joined us. And Curtis, I'm Ken Rogers.